Hi guys, it's Becky here and I am in my trash pit of a garage spray painting my plastic shutters. Um, I took them down last year and I are, am just now getting to spray painting them. So anyways, um, I'm going to be using this Krylon Outdoor Spaces spray paint to spray them. And the reason why I use this is because I asked a couple of roofers how to best refinish them and they said spray paint is the best option. So then I called Krylon. Krylon recommended this because it has some UV color fade and weather damage resistant in it. So, but it's unlike the normal Krylon stuff. Um, the normal Krylon, if you look closely at this nozzle, it has this nice spin feature. You can go left to right and spray, or you can turn it and go up and down, which I really love. And so I just went about spraying how I normally spray with this can and this can, and it didn't work very well. So as you can see on this one, it only goes up and down. So you have to hold the can up and down the entire time. It makes a huge difference. I'll show you the picture um, of the other one that I did not this way. So I'm going to show you, as boring as it is to watch me spray paint, if you are attempting to do this with this stuff on shutters similar to mine, then this is the way you want to spray it. So make sure you give it a good shake. I've, sh shake it. I have already shook it, so it's good to go. So I'm going to start on the side, and I'm going to hold my can like this and spray it up and down to go with the wood grain. You want to make sure you go, I mean this isn't real, real wood, but it's like a faux wood grain. And you want to go with the grain of the, the shutter. And then I come right over the top of it and spray up and down. And you want to spray your, shake your can a couple times while you're spraying it just to keep everything mixed really well. And I'm just about, I don't know, eight inches away from my shutter with this. And then I'll come back and do this side. Okay, so then when I get to right here, the wood grain's going this way, so then I'm going to go like this. And then the side, same thing. Okay, and so then when I do this part, I'm going to go... Okay, so basically I'm going to do the second half the same way I did the first, but I just kind of want to show you how to hold the can because it really makes a huge difference. Thanks.